I don't know who told you food that you must peel your beans before you can make akara or moi moi with it. Hello everybody, this is Dosat here. You're all welcome to my channel. So today I'll be showing you how I made a very yummy and crunchy akara with beans. I didn't peel it. Now, first of all, use any species of brown beans. You know, because of the iron black eye peel, the black um, peel show so it doesn't make their career attractive but with your brown beans like you blend it and then it comes out the same no black thing no nothing so the first thing i'm going to do i'm going to soak my beans for i'm going to wash the beans first i washed it like five times then i soaked it for 10 minutes please make sure you carry out that step then when i was done washing the beans and soaking it I poured it in my blender, added my pepper and onions. Please always put onions in your akara now. With if you don't like your akara spicy, just use small pepper. Can you see the little water I'm putting in this thing? When you are blending akara, you do not need to pour plenty water. You use you use just small water to blend your akara. So I'm going to now cover it and I'm going to blend. So because the akara doesn't have a lot of water inside, um, you usually use your blender stick. On the cover of your blender to blend your akara so that the blades will be able to move so i'm done blending my akara can you see this this looks so smooth it looks very thick make sure you always use your blade that blade the um the turning the stick there the tamper stick it will help you so when you're done what makes your akara fluffy and crunchy is you mixing the akara so i'm not going to be using a hand mixer i i'm using a stand mixer if you have a hand mixer use it if you don't have a hand mixer you can just use a wix but it's going to take a lot of time so this is me mixing it with um, a stand mixer i wix this for just three minutes on a very high speed if you're using your hand you might be using it for like uh 10 minutes your hand so see this can you see how fluffy this is can you see how fluffy? Before I mix it, I went ahead and added my salt. I add my salt in two batches because sometimes when you mix it, it becomes so full, like it doubles or triples in size. So it might not be that sweet again. So I usually add another salt inside. So this is me showing you. In case you do not have a mixer, a hand mixer, a stand mixer, just use your wix. And wix this with your power, like your whole full strength, your energy, your everything. Wix it for at least seven to ten minutes and you will see that your akara will double in size without this you will not get the crunchiness in your akara without this your akara will not be that fluffy and crunchy so another important step when you are frying your akara is your heat level please see me i use that smallest part of my gas when i'm frying akara and i use the medium heat of it i don't even use the full heat i use the medium heat of it when i'm frying akara also, do not allow your oil to become too hot. Once the oil is getting hot and can you can put something inside, just start frying it immediately. Because if you allow your oil to be too hot, it will not give you that kind of vibe. It's going to burn, and then you don't even be perceiving that kind of smell or anything. Always fry your kara on a low heat, like a very very low heat, so that it will fry well. See this? See me reducing it to the medium heat or low heat. So the medium, the low, perfect, but still I'm using a smaller gas angle. So I'm going to be flipping my akara. Can you see it's maintaining that akara color, but if the heat is too much, it's going to be brown. Uh, it won't give that akara smell or test. Please have you subscribed to my channel. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do. Also help me like and share my videos please like and share my videos also comment where you are watching from so that i'll give you a shout out in my next video this akara was so yummy can you see this so who said you can't fry akara without uh peeling the back see this look at how attractive this akara is it's so fine it's so so can you see how yummy our akara is look at this Oh goodness gracious, see this. So yummy. So a car like yeah. Yo. Mm. Oh, yeah I'll continue. Mm. This is out of this world.
so you don't necessarily need to peel the back of your beans see this extremely crunchy see this extremely crunchy so crunchy so crunchy see ah let me eat another one side it will enter your eyes see ah mm.